I've been having dreams. Dreams of the crossing. It's pulling me back. I was ready to start a new laugh. A new laugh with Klaus in the new land. It was good for a while. It was really good. The happy endings aren't what they're always cracked up to be. They can change on a dime. We've been having problems again. Problems with Slim. This kind of settling down life isn't exactly her way of living. And it's been bringing tension between us. I wasn't sure what to do. He told me he was going back. Make money. Fuck money. I didn't want him to leave. But what could I do? I couldn't stop him. I think I might have scared him away. I told him that I'd wait for his letter. So I did. The days passed. The weeks passed. The months. I never got a letter. And he never came back. There were countless times I tried to write. I wanted to write to him. But every time I tried, she'd be there, watching. I know Slim is there to protect me. But sometimes she can get overbearing. Especially when I'm alone. That's when it gets real bad. Did we... Drive him away. Riley. If he can't handle us, he should leave. Just shows where his priorities lie. And that's money. Not you. You see, I never leave you, Riley. You're stuck with me. And I'll take care of you. I'm not so sure anymore. What's not to be sure about? Life is so uncertain. It always will be. It never goes the way we want it to go. But that's the fun of it. What's life if there's no chaos? If he wants to ride back, he'll ride back. So put that pin down and wait. Truth is, I don't do so well on my own. I get worse than being out here alone. Without him. Without my family. It was tearing me apart. I couldn't tell you how many times I just kept staring out that window watching watching seeds blowing in the wind almost like they're beckoning me to come outside so I did I got a breath of fresh air and I looked down and I saw a dandelion by the doorsteps when I went down to pick it up I, I saw a letter underneath the porch. It's been sitting there God knows how long. And it was from Klaus. He decided to stay. And he was begging me to come back. How could I not? I love him. I'd do anything for him. I should have written him back to let him know I was on my way, but... 
I knew that I should just go. I wasn't even thinking. I grabbed what I could and I left. I left to go back home. Home. <laughs> I've been having dreams. Dreams of the crossing. <laughs> It's pulling me back. Besides, I can't let him have all the fun. 